Hi everyone, it's Milani and welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I wanted to jump on camera and film a very quick review and a little demonstration for you guys. So today we're reviewing this Benetint Rose Tinted Lip and Cheek Stain is from Benefit. So they have two sizes. This is the travel or mini size and this is 0.2 fluid ounces. This was $18 and I got mine at Sephora. And I picked mine up when I had the 20% off. So it came down a couple of dollars, but they do have a larger full size, I believe is $30. So I wanted to test it out because I love lip tints and I'm constantly looking for the best lip tint for me. So I purchased a couple and I've been testing a couple of them out and just filming little reviews and letting you guys know which, you know, what I think about all of them and then which I primarily like the most. So I've been testing this out for a couple of weeks and this is what the packaging looks like. So it is, oh my gosh, I almost dropped it. So this is what it looks like. It is a nice packaging, very cute little glass container. It's just, it, the packaging is very, very cute love cute packaging so looking at this it looks kind of terrifying it looks kind of scary it looks very dark and very intense this is not how it goes on this is not how it applies now this is a lip and cheek tint so you can apply this on your face and on your lips i don't apply this on my cheeks i primarily only use this on my lips so that's how i'm going to demonstrate it for you uh, first of all let me just get this out of the way. I absolutely love this product. I think it is a great product. I think the formula is amazing. I think a little goes a very long way. And I don't have enough good things to say about this. So the best way that I found to apply this is if you're going to put it on your face, I would wash your face completely and have clean skin. That's the best way it's going to. That's the that's the best way it's going to last the longest because when I put it on my lips, I always make sure that my lips are hydrated, but then they're washed. So you know what I mean? I'll hydrate my lips and then before I'll make sure that I exfoliate, get all the product residue off. So then this will just adhere to my skin and last. But at the same time, you want to make sure your lips aren't super dry. So right now I do have a little bit of lip balm on. I'm just going to take it off just for the sake of the video so I can show you guys what it looks like. Normally my lips would be have no product on it for me to put it on but even if I do have a little bit of lip balm on there's not there's not too much of a difference so with this you don't need to shake it or anything like that but I mean it's a liquid product so if you want to go ahead it's not going to make a difference so when you open it it does have and I think they changed the dofa applicators I think it used to be a brush and now it's an actual just little lip wand so when you smell it it has a very, very, it smells like roses. It smells like roses. And if you're new to my channel or if you're not, I love the smell of roses. It's one of my favorite scents ever. So with this, all I'm going to do is just apply this on my lips and it's very liquidy. And I just mush my lips together. It's so good. I don't even need to add on the top or bottom, but do you see how it instantly gives you a color? Now I do want to say with this product, you taste it. It does not taste good. It does not taste good at all. It tastes like it has a perfume scent to it, but I'm assuming it's coming from the rose scent. It's you're tasting it on your lips. So I don't really care for that. I think out of, I think that's actually my only complaint with this product. I don't like that you can taste the product on your lips, but I love the natural tint it gives your lips. And I know they have a couple of different ones. I haven't tried their other ones either, but I think the formulas on their other lip tints are very different. So keep that in mind when you are looking at their other ones. I think the formula is completely different from it. This one looks very liquidy, very watery, but it just instantly just dries down. I don't feel like I need to blend out anything with my fingers. And I like not having to do that because sometimes these lip tints will stain your fingers and then that can just kind of be a pain to get off. But I've never had to blend it out with my fingers or anything like that. Just kind of mush my lips together and it goes on. You can put this on underneath your lipstick or if you don't want to wear lipstick or on top of your lipstick and just kind of transform or add a little bit of color to it. You can put it on your face. Some people put it on if they don't want to wear makeup. They'll put it on before they apply their blush or 
whatever and it just gives their skin a nice little flush of color but I do really like this I've been testing out another liquid I'm sorry another lip tint and so far this one is hands down my favorite based off of the consistency the formula and the color I feel like a little goes such a long way and it does last a good couple of hours you can reapply as much as you want and there's just no issue it doesn't get super super aggressive so I feel like you're you're not gonna get carried away or overboard and you literally saw I only put the smallest amount and just blend my lips together and this is this is what I'm left with and my lips are gonna stay like this for the next couple hours so like I said if you're someone who doesn't like the way roses smell you're probably not gonna like this I love the way it smells it's probably one of my favorite things and as far as yeah everything else but the only thing like I said I don't care for is that you can taste the product on your lips after a little bit it will go away but it's it's a very strong taste when you first put it on so I just want you to keep that in mind so I'm going to end this video here I really hope this video helps some of you guys I hope it was helpful informative and yeah, I'm going to end this video here please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video